We are on the verge. And the reason we know that we are going to be able to learn is because we are not all the same. You can't learn from people who are exactly the same. Difference is the source of learning. Maybe we should, we should put it on a, on, a, on a t-shirt. Difference is a gift so that we understand and don't fear so that we're able to go up to the person most different from us and ask them the question we most fear asking. So really, we can expand and learn. We live in a world of either or. We're trying to make a world of and. So it is about shared humanity in perfect balance with difference. And I hope this weekend we think not only about difference, uh, in conventional labels, but in terms of uniqueness. Each one of us is unique. Because the truth of the matter is that the individual is more different from the next individual than a group is from a group. There are more differences between two individual females or members of the same ethnic group or race than there are between males and females or between races and ethnic groups. Each one of us in this room is a unique combination of millennia upon millennia of heredity and environment combined in a way that could never have happened before and could never happen again. And anybody who's ever met a baby knows there's a person already in that baby, right? And our job as the parents and families and allies of children is to help them become who they already are. I always think of it in terms of flowers in a way, you know, that somebody's an iris or a petunia and trouble comes when you try to make them into a rose or lilac, you just get an unhappy iris or petunia. <laughs> so the question is, who, who are, what is this unique wisdom? Who is the guide who is inside us? And can we see the uniqueness of each individual, whether or not it conforms to any, any of the, the labels?